Well, during a freeze warning, people are reminded to bring their pets and plants indoors. But for one local grower, he's not able to bring his 5,000 acres of citrus trees indoors, so he's come up with a plan to protect them outdoors. As temperatures drop below freezing, citrus plants become at risk. On the really cold nights when the fruit could freeze, what happens then is um, in a couple of weeks it starts, gets kind of watery, funny taste, and then eventually it starts drying out. Once the fruit is frozen, it's unsellable. This is the second freeze warning in a row for the San Joaquin Valley. It's going to be cool enough tonight to get, it's definitely got our attention. John Gless, the vice president and general manager of Gless Ranch, with 45 years of farming experience, says he has a plan in place to protect his fruit from the freezing temperatures. We've got a, a frost team that's been doing it for a long time and uh, we, we have a pretty good idea what time the temperatures are supposed to drop and that's when everybody goes into action. The first line of defense against freezing temperatures are the wind machines. The propellers are 30 feet high where the air called the inversion layer is four to six degrees warmer. You're blowing warmer air down on the tree and just generating the movement of the tree. Uh, warms it up. Depending on how warm that layer is, it could warm the tree from four to six degrees. The wind machine covers up to 15 acres, rotates 360 degrees, and can be set to idle when the temperature gets to a certain level. Gless will be running all 280 of his wind machines tonight to protect his citrus orchards. One part of farming that, that it's not fun. You know, you, it's, 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 it's really weird when you know you could go out and lose everything in one night. Tonight I don't anticipate that kind of cold weather, but we have had nights like that. When you're going out and they're calling for temperatures that you know could, you know, mean you know, everything that you've worked for for the last year could be over in one night. Well, now Gless says that he's not expecting the freeze warning tonight to impact either his citrus orchards or the citrus prices in your grocery store. He says that he'll only lose sleep. Live in studio, Amanda Mason, 23 ABC.